All right, here's another great question. Why rent an RV? Why should I rent an RV? So I'm just gonna kind of go off of all the various reasons why you should rent an RV. Um, number one, it's because you want to. That's the biggest reason. You want to do it. Maybe it's something on your bucket list. Uh, maybe it's something you've been planning. Maybe you did it with, you know, as a child or whatever the case may be. It's just because you want to do it. Um, another reason is because it's actually economical in some regards. Depending on your itinerary or what you're trying to do, this could easily be comparable to renting a car and, you know, driving to said location or national park and then staying in a hotel and then constantly having to get in and out of that hotel to go do whatever it is you're doing for that day. That's one great reason to do it. Um, now, mind you, of course, there is still fuel and obviously RVs, you know, motorhomes, travel trailers, they don't get as great a fuel mileage as your personal vehicle. But again, this is refer back to number one because you want to do this and it's it's a different experience. Another reason why, kind of going with number two, is because um, you've got your house on wheels, all your luggage is with you. If you've got small children, you know, you can buckle them in, you can stop along the way. Uh, maybe if you have people that need to go to the bathroom a bunch, you know, whatever the reason, you have your house on wheels and you can go or leave at your convenience. You don't have, you're not like set to anything in particular. So that's another great reason to do it. And that's one that I personally like uh, because I have kids and yes, I've hauled my kids in my personal vehicle and that's fine. Um, but sometimes it's just nice to have that extra space or to be able to stop and, you know, fix them some food or whatever. Uh, let's see, what's another great reason? Um, so you're not all crammed, kind of going back to what I was just saying. So you're not all crammed in this tight little car or truck or whatever it is, driving across country, or driving to national parks. It's great to be able to spread your legs out and just have some extra room. Uh, let's see, what are some other great reasons that you know people tell me or that I can think of? Um, like, it's, it's awesome that you can, every, there's usually windows in most of these, uh, RVs or motorhomes, I should say. So if you're doing it that route and you're driving yourself, um, everybody can look out the window, which is really, really nice. Um, hopefully all the electronics are put to the side and people can kind of look out the window and explore. Um, what else is good about renting an RV? Um, you know, the travel trailer option, that again, just kind of gives you the ability to throw everything in the back of your truck, just hook up to a trailer and just head out and just go somewhere fun for the weekend. You don't need to go on some long trip necessarily. Um, you just maybe go into a local state park or, you know, some of the places to go fish or whatever. Um, that's another great reason to do it. But I don't know that I'm sure I could think of a lot, but those are probably the top four or five that I could think of right now. And yeah, it's just, the biggest thing is it's a great experience. It's another alternative to taking a vacation. Um, so yeah, I think that's it. That's all I can think of. <laughs> if I can think of anything else, I'll make another video, I suppose. But anyways, thanks for watching. You guys have a great day. Watch some of our other videos.